it's time to give the ECX Torment a Doug score. Geronimo! The ECX Torment is a rear wheel drive short course truck which is owned by Horizon Hobby, the same company that owns Vatera and Losi. ECX was formerly called Electris RC and the Torment is based on the Ruckus Monster Truck. Now it's time for the Doug score. <laughs> Starting with styling, the Torment looks cool and its distinctive design easily earns a good 17 points. Top speed's actually pretty good for a car powered by a 6, 7 cell nickel metal hydride battery. ECX didn't put a top speed on the box unlike Traxxas, but I believe based on what I see, it's probably between around 25 to 27 miles an hour. I'll easily compromise and give it a good 8 points. Handling is mediocre. The servo included in the car does respond to steering commands, but it ain't powerful enough to turn the car into sharp corners. Also, the tires that are included with the car almost feel like plastic, so it easily earns 10 points. Acceleration is pretty snappy. It's one of the best accelerating brush cars, so it easily gets 21 points. Added together and the Celestial score is 56 points, which is average. Keep in mind that this is an entry level RC car. <laughs> now the story changes just a little bit in the Lunar Chart. Starting off with durability. Durability is actually pretty good. My cousin bashed this RC car off rams and crashed it with my slash during my summer bash session. So it easily gets 19 points. I will put the link in the end screen after this video. Uh, that barrel, but it, if it only landed on the wheels. With features and equipment, since this is an entry-level RC car, I wouldn't expect Tesla tech quality, like low C or associated, etc. But I was somewhat wrong on that. This car includes a Spectrum DX2E 2.4 GHz transmitter, which compares to Traxxas 2.4 GHz transmitters, the Spectrum is actually twice as good. ECX also offers metal gears, brushless editions and all-wheel drive models so it easily earns a good 21 points. Quality is good, however the drive shafts are kind of weak and I could have said it should have been a fluke but that didn't happen. My uncle and my cousin had to make trips to their local hobby store to buy like 8 pairs so it gets only 16 points. And finally value. For under $200 this is one of the best buys you can get. I do understand that this car isn't as versatile as the Slash, but I know newbie hobbyists will enjoy this car so it earns a strong 20 points. Add it all together and the Looter score is 76 points, close to the Slash's 79 points. The final Doug score for the ECX Torment is 132 out of 200. Personally, I like this car, but I still remain a Traxxas guy so I'm pretty much going to be buying a lot of Traxxas cars. But maybe one day. After I get myself a Traxxas 4 Tech 2.0, I may consider buying an ECX Torment.